I think what I've learned from having friendships with people with learning disabilities is actually we're all pretty similar. We all want to be loved for who we are. We all want to belong. We all want to be missed when we're not there. We all need people in our lives that love us even on the bad days or when things aren't going so well. Maybe people with learning disabilities express that in a different way or maybe can't hide it as easily as people that don't have disabilities. But I think we're all basically the same, that we need people to be there for us in the good times and the bad times, whether you've got a disability or not. It is unique and uh, I, I consider myself uh, blessed to be able to work with and live with people with living disabilities. I've been able to learn a lot of things about myself and about how to help and then listen. I, thought, I used to think I was a good listener but coming to Lash has taught me to listen and then also be more patient and more understanding coming here i've realized that you know there are friends of large and people in large who are from different religious backgrounds different social backgrounds and all of us just come together and we're one big family so it, it's truly amazing <laughs> Uh, I think what I like most about Lash is um, the sense of sort of complete acceptance and that there isn't a need to perform, um, that you can be as, as noisy or as quiet as you like or as energetic or as um, kind of laid back um, and people accept you as you are. I think the thing that surprised me the most about Lash was um, how little distinction there often is between core members and assistants. Um, that often it's difficult to tell um, who is in which role and I think um, Lash really makes an effort to and succeeds in um, treating everyone equally and with respect um, and recognising that um, people have different levels of independence, different kinds of needs but that we're all equally valuable.